Like and subscribe now, or you're going to have bad luck this week. Earth has been around for quite a few billion years, and although we often look back at dinosaurs as some of the most terrifying creatures that ever existed, there are others who have been more disgusting or terrifying. Bloodthirsty and ruthless, these creatures have been long gone, but are still nightmare-inducing. From ocean creatures bigger than the Titanic to rhino-sized pigs, let's take a look at 10 animals we're glad don't exist anymore. Number 10. The Lead Scythus Alright, it seems like we are going off by going straight for the bullseye. You might not have heard about this creature, but it's one of the most historically terrifying creatures the world has ever seen. Lead Scythus was a giant fish that would have dwarfed every other animal in the sea. But, like the whale shark, which is currently the biggest fish in the sea, it was a gentle giant and lived on tiny shrimp, jellyfish, and small fish that make up plankton. They probably traveled large distances to find parts of the world where seasonal conditions caused plankton to form itself into a dense, concentrated organic soup. Once a year, and probably after plankton feasts, lead scythes would have shed the giant filter plates from the back of its mouth, meaning it was unable to feed itself for several weeks, whilst the new ones grew back. Towards the end of this time, it would have been weakened through hunger and vulnerable to attack. We should be glad this creature doesn't exist in our seas, otherwise there wouldn't be any ships sailing out there. Number 9. Paraceratherium We think some of you would be surprised when the elephant wasn't included in the world's biggest animals. Well, today we're giving you something bigger than the elephant, and it's not the mammoth. We're talking about the Paraceratherium which holds the title of being the largest land mammal that has ever lived. They were about 7 meters tall, which makes them taller than modern-day giraffes, and they weighed between 33 and 44,000 pounds. This makes them almost three times heavier than the heaviest elephants that we have today. Just like elephants, they were not an immediate threat to other animals or humans because they were herbivores, but with a size that big, we are sure they were intimidating and kept predators at a distance. It seems like they went extinct when the landscapes in Central Asia started to transform, making it hard for the Paraceratherium to find the means to survive. We wonder what it would have been like to see one of these in the wild. We're sure we would have been able to spot them from very, very far away. Number 8. Super Crocs The name Super Croc Killer Croc, or Mega Croc, as you may deem fit, was given to any of the crocodilian species that ruled the ecosystem about 100 million years ago. And that includes the Saracosicus from Africa and South America, estimated at 37 feet, 17,000 pounds. The Danosuchus from North America at 18,000 pounds and the Perusaurus from Amazon that could extend up to 39 feet at a whopping 22,000 pounds. Super crocs prey on mighty dinosaurs like the large duck-billed Hadrosaurus and Spinosaurus. They also fed on pteropods, which belong to a dino family that includes even the mighty Tyrannosaurus rex. But while megalodons could only drive you out of the water, super crocs could keep up on both water and in land because they were well adapted for hunting in both places. When experts tried to simulate how deadly they were, these massive predators could break the bones of a fully grown cow and a metallic chain in the single bite. It's not like we're so happy that these animals went extinct, but the mere thought of a predator strong enough to feast on dinosaurs, which are among the most successful animals of all time, might keep us, and even you, from reconsidering. Number 7. Megalodon Aside from being the biggest and deadliest sharks, megalodons are also one of the largest fish ever to exist in history, with an insatiable craving for flesh. They have jaws lined with 276 teeth, wide enough to swallow two adult men standing side by side like it's nothing, and each tooth is capable of delivering a bite force that is 138 times stronger than a man's. To put it this way, the great white sharks, which are the largest meat-eating sharks that exist today, attack over 100 humans per year. 
How much more would it be for another, known to be more ferocious with a size three times larger than the largest great white? If the Megalodon were still around, just forget snorkeling, outdoor swimming, and your next surfing picnics because the ocean would definitely be off limits. But don't be glad just yet because these big bad boys, which we believe died out 2.6 million years ago, have been reportedly sighted in several parts of the world even on Google Maps. If you want to find out whether these claims are real or fake, check out our video titled Top 10 Megalodons Caught on Camera. Number 6. Saber-Toothed Tiger The modern humans first wandered into Europe some 50,000 years ago. This snaggletoothed cat was probably there to greet them. Until about 10,000 years ago, the saber-toothed tiger was a fearsome predator in what is now the American West. More than 3,000 fossilized cats have been pulled from the acrid ooze of the La Brie tar pits in California. The species is actually much older than thought before. Fossil evidence dates to around 1.8 million years ago. The saber-toothed tiger is remembered with wonder as a relic of the last ice age. Despite its size, weighing in at around 5 feet long and 440 pounds, and its two 7-inch canine teeth, environmental change, lack of food, and human hunting saw this fascinating beast die off from the face of the earth. There are various theories on how this creature went extinct, but some researchers believe that it still exists in the colder parts of the world. There has been no proof, but the North and South Poles are still barely discovered, so we can never rule out their existence. If they do exist, we need to be scared as they might take revenge on humans. Are you strong enough to fight this huge beast? Number 5. Shastasaurus Everybody knows that chewing your food carefully is part of a good table manner. No one told that to the Shastasaurus. The size of this marine reptile was between 8 to 15 meters, and it was probably a suction feeder that slurped up little cephalopods and squids in the late Triassic seas some 200 million years ago. Shastasaurus was not a dinosaur. Instead, this creature was an ichthyosaur, a member of a group of fish-shaped marine reptiles that became, that became beautifully adapted to a life spent entirely at sea. The Shastasaurus differed from the rest of its family in a strange way. Whereas most other ichthyosaurs had long snouts filled with small, conical teeth suited to snatching fish and cephalopods, Shastasaurus had a shortened, toothless jaw. Scientists believe that the evolution of the Shastasaurus might be attributed to a boom in squid, which itself was caused by a decrease in ocean oxygen levels. One of the most fascinating facts about Shastasaurus is the fact that it lived primarily off of small fish, cephalopods, and squids. This makes it very similar to a modern-day sperm whale because they both have very similar diets. However, despite their similarity in size and diet, Shastasaurus and sperm whales are in no way related to one another. Number 4. Argentinosaurus Today, the African elephant is considered the largest terrestrial animal alive. But during the late Cretaceous period, a different beast ruled the land. It was the Argentinosaurus that dwelled in the region that is now Argentina. Yes, you guessed it right, he got his name from there too. Most of its remains aren't complete, which has made it difficult to determine the exact size. But nevertheless, it's considered to be among the largest land animals ever. It is believed to have been 98 to 130 feet in length and 50 to 100 tons in weight. How huge is that? That giant can move at a speed of 5 miles per hour. Imagine the destruction it would cause during its morning run. Number 3. Titanomarma We're just sure you didn't expect to see an ant on this list. However, this is not a normal ant. Titanomarma was a genus of giant ant that lived during the Eocene about 60 million years ago. This ant was the size of a hummingbird, and it roamed what is now Wyoming. These giant bugs may have crossed an Arctic land bridge between Europe and North America during a particularly warm period in Earth's history, about 2 inches 5 centimeters long. The specimen is a monstrously big ant, though fossils of loose giant ant wings have been found before in the United States. This is the first known full-body specimen. Number 2. Titanoboa 
After the last dinosaurs died 65 million years ago, our planet witnessed the rise of the Great Titanoboas, which were giant reptiles known to be the largest snakes ever to roam the land. They clearly must have been the apex predator because Titanoboas were stealth hunters that didn't mind feeding on anything from a 7 foot long lungfish to turtles or massive crocodiles multiple times larger than what we have today. We can bet we humans didn't even stand a chance. It's estimated up to 48 feet long, 2,500 pounds. When you bring to perspective, that makes the largest green anaconda on Earth measured at 882 pounds appear like spaghetti. It might be good news for the other animals, especially for the crocodiles in this era, big enough to escape an encounter with one, that these massive beasts were not venomous, just like the modern day anacondas but with hefty muscles that can squeeze like placing three Eiffel Towers on top of you. They were the perfect crushing machine you didn't want roaming anywhere in your dreams. Number 1. Deodon One of the most vicious animals after the extinction of the dinosaurs, Deodon, also known as the Dreadful Tooth, is an extinct genus of hell pigs that inhabited North America between 29 and 19 million years ago. Deodon's skull alone measured almost a meter in length. It was 1.8 meters tall and once roamed North America, eating just about anything it could find. This could be why it was known as the Terminator Pig. Travelers would have typically found Deodon traveling in packs, devouring anything and everything that gets within sight. Once combat is initiated, one or sometimes all of the pack will produce a pheromone effect to buff the health regeneration of friendly creatures. Deodon was a large mammal with hunched shoulders and cloven hooves. It has a massive head and long jaws. With its massive size and nightmarish teeth, it is easy to forget that this animal is part of the pig family. Which one of these animals do you wish existed today? Let us know in the comments, and if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel.